And number one is to ordain a uh, ministry. He's not a new ministry. He's been ministering for quite a few years, but he's a friend of Brother Tony's. And uh, we feel privileged that they chose our assembly to be able to, as a congregation, pray over Brother Samuel. He's originally from Liberia, I believe, and then lives in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania now, and has been ministering the gospel. And so I want Brother Tony to come and say a few words about him, and then we're going to lay our hands on him, ordain him to the ministry. We feel privileged when new uh, brothers take on the burden and uh, be able to carry the word of God, a big responsibility today. And so we just want to join with Brother Tony in our prayers for Brother Samuel that the Lord would bless his ministry and further it and whatever doors the Lord should open, we want to be able to be a part of that. Amen. We'll give him a little certificate today also from the church for his ordination. And uh, so Brother Tony, come brother, here's a microphone and uh, just share a couple words there. Praise the Lord. Good morning, everyone. God bless you this morning. Uh, thank you, Pastor Paul. We Thank the Lord for this privilege to bring our brother, Brother Samuel Jebo, before you this today to ordain into the ministry. He actually requested to be ordained since last year when I was in Florida, but the Lord knows all things. We couldn't do it until now. I want to thank Pastor Paul for the encouragement to do this for our brother, because that, that means a lot to a minister. Yes. When you are called to the ministry, you want to make sure that he, an, a, a the Holy Ghost filled man of God lays hand on you and pray for you. That is to commit you and that gift to the hands of the Lord. Because when you come to the ministry, you're going to fight a lot of battles more than any other Christians. And uh, just like when we have a new baby born, I probably said we dedicate the babies and give them back to the Lord. Before the devil have a chance on the baby, God can take care of the baby. And that's why it is with the gift of God in the man. So, Brother Samuel, I'll just say a few things. Uh, God help me. You don't trust the minister with the pulpit. <laughs> no, no, we're gonna have a, we're gonna feast to this morning. But our uh, brother here, uh, brother Samuel, uh, we're gonna call him up in a few minutes and have minister come out and to pray with us in your, your church. Uh, Proverbs said that the minister's qualification is to be married to one wife, not two, just one wife. And now also, he said we do not believe in important gift on the minister. We have to see the gift in his life. And we just pray for the, that gift and commit that gift to the hands of the Lord to protect him. Because as the minister, he's going to fight more demons than before. But the Brown said, each time he goes to study to bring the message, he said, 26 miles radius, I think of demons. You see, that's why we have to pray for ministers and the gift in their life. And uh, brother is going to be prayed for this morning before we, by Apostle, goes with the, the, the program today. Bro, can you please come, Brother Samuel, please? At this time, I want to invite all the minister, Brother Brandon, uh, Brother Josiah, come on. Um, all the ministers in the house, please come. Uh, let, we're going to pray for our brother at this time. Uh, church, can you please stand time with us at this time? Let's stand together, church. Let's pray for our brother. Father, that they are Lord Jesus, we brother Samuel. Yes, hands on that brother and Lord Samuel. Lord Jesus, he's been identified as a minister and uh, thank you for speaking the word of God. The ministry, Lord Jesus. These many years, Lord, and never oh, been God. prayed over or ordained. It's a honor for us to lay I pray, hands on Lord him. Jesus, as Brother Tony to has seen his life and seen his ministry, in, in the I pray you'll further it, Lord. To I pray brother. that he would recognize yeah, Jesus, bless the importance, ministry. Lord, of the word that he send handles. Him forth to the world to have the fires to bring of God your son, and take Jesus them from Christ the altar. To the world, the light of this day, Extremely Lord. important for the body of Christ. Be on fire for bless him, for help you, Lord. him, Lord. Strengthen him, Lord, in the word of God. Him, bless his family, Open up Lord, the word time, to him, Lord, Father. I pray. Open doors of God, may he put the priority not only on the word, but his character, his life, the example that he sets to the rest of the world. For protection. These things are so important, Lord. You gave us in the word of God. Thank you, Lord. His qualifications Thank you, Lord for a Jesus. minister. Hallelujah, I pray, Father, you'll help him. Thank you, Lord. Build up a defense, Lord, yes, against Lord. the enemy's attacks. Yes, Lord Jesus. And Lord God, I pray you purify Hallelujah, this man Lord. for the work of the gospel of yes. Jesus Christ. Amen, as we commit him to you, Lord, yes, Lord, in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Yes, Lord. We ask it. Amen and amen. amen. Praise amen. the Lord. Praise the Lord. Amen. God bless, brother. Congratulations, brother. God bless you. God bless you. Okay. 
God bless you, saints. Uh, I want to thank God for such a great opportunity like this. Uh, like the preacher just said, you know, ordination does not put a gift into a man. It's just to sanction the gift that God has placed in the man already, even from the foundation of the world. So I'm privileged to be in your midst, and I just want to thank you all. Just continue to pray for me as we continue to add reach and preach the gospel to the rest of the world. The prophet said the word is your puppet, so we can preach anywhere we see souls are dying. Amen. So God bless you all. Amen. 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 Stay here for a picture. Do you have your camera? Do you have your camera? You may be seated. You better get a picture of this. You may not ever get one again. the Lord.